Line them up. Rolo, Ed, Rebo, three, Taz, four, Ross, five, Mike, six, Via, seven. Marshals, in your positions. Eyes on the prize. You're good, dude. You ready? Oh, save that. Put it in your pocket. Charlie, keep your eye on this corner. It's going to be uh, aggressive. Lock pack ready to rock. You will go on the toe. This is race number three, super stock truck. Race four, stock buggy. You are up next. That will be Roy Dalia, Revo, Patrick Ferris, Chris Carnes, and Tommy K. We have a race between Roy Dowler, who's in the orange and the yellow, and Ed Patson in the orange and black. Ross Rhodes coming in from Nitro. Has he lost his Nitro finger yet? We'll find out. See how this main entertains. Ross Rhodes looking to position himself into second place to see if Roy Dowler can hold him off. Ed Patson's looking for some daylight, wanting to check out. Mike Eli always straps it up for the big events. He's saying he ain't gonna lose me that fast. Taz in the line green coming in fourth. They're all on the back straightaway. This will be a great race. Your leader in the orange and black, Ed Patson, coming down the back straightaway, followed by Roy Dallier about 10 feet behind, followed by Ross Rose by about 20 feet. Mike Eli looking to put a pass on him, and he checks himself and Ross Rose in the corner. If this was the world, he would get a five-second stop and go. He suffers enough. He drops back into last. Ross Rose only has a few feet to make up his back position. In fact, he never even lost his position. Roy Dowdy puts the pass on the outside to see if he can hold off Ed from the inside. Roy Dowdy is now in first place, followed by Ed Patson, four feet behind him, going through the center, uh, center combo. He waits for Roy. Nice. That's etiquette at its best. Roy Dowdy takes back to position. Ed uh, Patson's just behind him, going over the triple. Ross Rhodes trying to make up about 50 feet, followed by Taz. Taz is looking for a podium spot. Let's see if he can put a move on Ross. That ain't gonna happen that turn around. That was a costly triple. Revo moves into fourth, gets taken away by Taz instantly. Revo's going to put a move on him. Nope, he stuffed it in the corner, so now we're back. Roy Dallier's putting some distance between him and Ed. White truck, you may want to get out of the way of the orange and black. Thank you very much. We're back into a race between Roy Dowdy and Ed Patson. Roy's looking confident, but if he makes a mistake, Ed will capitalize for taking over first place. Ross Rhodes in a solid third place position, followed by Taz. Paul Padilla is still rocking that low. He's fresh off his championship victory in SC. He does not need a second championship. Now he's just out for a joy ride with the other dog. <laughs> Ed Patson takes over first place from Roy Dallier going through the combo. Roy Dallier's looking to make a pass on the inside. Nope. Ed Patson shuts him down. Ed's holding a smooth line. Roy's punching hard. He's landing that triple. He's just over two. Not getting any traction on that lander. He's squared up. He's wanting to go big. He does. Ed just cuts it off. Oh, Roy's poking his nose in it. Can Ed close him off? Yeah, Ed takes him. No. Roy's being smart about this, understanding this race will not. Oh, my goodness. I can guarantee you these two have not had this much fun in a long time. They're enjoying this completely. Each of them wants this championship because they will rub it in each and every week to each other. The only thing missing is Ed's daughter, Shayna, which would be right in between them, causing constant mayhem. Roy Dowd is going to have to pull something out of his hat because Ed's just as consistent as it's going to be. He'll just keep shutting him down. Roy Dowd is looking for that hole, but Ed will not open it up. Ed puts a distance in between them. Now going over the double down the straightaway. Roy's a full straightaway behind. Ross Rhodes slowly creeping up in this. Nope, he is putting pressure on Roy Dowd from behind. 
Ross Rhodes coming through the center combo. Roy Gal, you're not using, used to having this much pressure for second position. We have one minute, 15 seconds left in this race. Roy Dow is going to settle in and start stalking Ed real quick here. Ed's just going to try and stay consistent, put some distance between him and Roy Dow here. A little bit more distance. Super D's right there to make the Marshall. One minute. That is a long time to make a move you need to make. Paul Padilla, that's your second place coming up behind you. Thank you, sir. Third place, Ross Rhodes. Ross Rhodes looking to take second place away from Roy Dallier. Roy Dallier should be able to stave him off, but if Roy's got something, here's the triple from Roy. Ross just doubles. Ross is Mr. Consistent. You've got about 30 seconds left. Ed Pats are coming up in the lap traffic. The yellow and black is your first place driver. He's got to get past Revo. Can he do it? Is Revo going to let him through? He does. Roy Dalley is coming up from behind. Let's see if Roy Dalley can get through these two drivers. Make the pass. 20 seconds left. Ross Rhodes coming in from third, looking for a second place finish in this uh, event. Two seconds left. Ed makes it for another race. He doesn't. Revo, you're done. Mike, you're done. Ross, you're done. Rolo, you're done. We're looking for Ed Patch in the finish. Taz to finish. I don't know how Reed and Roy's done. That's how the tumble. Ed Patch takes Rolo second. Ross Rhodes third. We have a race. We are going to need a couple of volunteer marshals. These guys are running back to back. This is race number four, Stock Buggy. Race five, Mod Buggy A Main, Uncle E, Scott Rapport, Dan Cook, Paul Edwards, Ken Wessendorf, Russ Heath, and Charlie are on deck.